Adams County is one of many areas getting another strong wave of stormy weather. One of our producers shot this video earlier. This follows Monday evening storms and the damage that they caused in several counties. We received numerous reports of trees knocked down on local roadways as well as power lines. Let's go live now. The 12 News is Jalen Anderson and Storm Chaser Lightning. Jalen, where are you now and what have you been seeing? Yeah, that's right, Byron. We're currently down here in Jackson on Monument near Bailey Avenue. As you can see right here, this is why you want to avoid standing water. Right here, as you see, right under this bridge, we have a car that is fully collapsed in this water. If we could zoom in right now, we're having some little troubles, but you can see the top of this car right here. This is why you want to avoid the standing water. Now, in this area, we've seen, you know, light, light rain so far, a few lightning strikes every now and then, no heavy winds to report. And and if you are traveling on these roads, make sure you are cautious and also make sure you keep your distance from other cars as, as break and reaction times are longer in these wet conditions. And also stay weather aware by downloading the 12 News app on your phone. And if you have to get out the house, don't forget those rain boots and umbrellas. For now, reporting live from Storm Tracker Lightning, Jalen Anderson, 12 News.